Hello, this is Dr. Vasquez, and what I'd like to do in this brief presentation is review some of my past work and introduce to you also some of my uh, more recent publications on the topic of hypertension, particularly as relevant to the chiropractic profession's role in the management of chronic hypertension. I've published several books now and articles on this topic. Uh, in this slide, I'll just provide a very brief introduction to my background and training, just so you'll know the perspective from which I approach the management of hypertension. My educational background is that of a doctor of chiropractic, a doctor of naturopathic medicine, and a doctor of osteopathic medicine. I've also been involved in professional education, uh, postgraduate training for many years, and uh, currently I am on faculty at two universities, uh, some postgraduate uh, educational groups, and I also have a private practice here in Portland, Oregon. Uh, in addition to this, I've also published many articles in peer-reviewed journals and professional magazines. My publications specific to the topic of hypertension include an article published in Naturopathy Digest in 2006. This was followed in 2009 uh, by a chapter on hypertension in my book, Chiropractic and Naturopathic Mastery of Common Clinical Disorders. In 2010, I published Chiropractic Management of Chronic Hypertension. This was a monograph uh, of three parts, uh, totaling about 240 pages. In 2010, I also published an article in Dynamic Chiropractic entitled, uh, Chiropractors Managing Chronic Hypertension, an Idea Whose Time Has Arrived. In 2011, I published a more advanced monograph on the topic of hypertension entitled Integrative Medicine and Functional Medicine for Chronic Hypertension. Uh, I'm actually quite proud of this piece of work in particular. It came out to be about 286 pages, a very thorough review of nutritional, pharmacologic, manipulative, and surgical treatments for chronic hypertension. Uh, more recently, in September of 2011, I updated that information and included an entire new chapter on laboratory assessment, physical exam, history taking uh, that brings the total page count now to 390 pages. And the title of this work is Integrative Chiropractic Management of High Blood Pressure and Chronic Hypertension, the updated and expanded second edition, I'm calling it. So uh, this is a representative sampling of some of my publications, and in particular ones on hypertension, all of which, of course, are thoroughly referenced to um, reputable sources, particularly peer-reviewed journals from biomedical journals. As you can see from the information on this slide, hypertension is the most common diagnosis in the practice of uh, medicine and the practice of healthcare. So I think that this data provides uh, significant uh, implications for the chiropractic profession, given that this is the number one diagnosis in the practice of healthcare. Uh, in my opinion, hypertension is a major contributor to overall healthcare expenses and catastrophic and unnecessary morbidity and mortality. And the chiropractic profession, as a major healthcare discipline, has the ability and therefore the responsibility to address this problem, which is of major public health significance. For individual practitioners, the chiropractic management of hypertension can be professionally and financially gratifying, and that's because the best assessments and treatments are already within the chiropractic scope, and the treatment responds very well to uh, non-drug treatment. For the chiropractic profession, hypertension rep represents an epic opportunity con to contribute to public health and therefore to rise in esteem and respect within the interdisciplinary healthcare community. Thank you for your interest, and I hope you'll take a moment to look up more information about my books, either at my website, which is optimalhealthresearch.com, or at Amazon.com, for example, and other major bookstores that carry my books. Thank you again, and uh, wish you the best of health and success.